एवरीवन दिस इज एस एम आरिफ टूडे वेलकमिंग यू टू माई न्यू फोटोशॉप ट्यूटोरियल एक्चुअली दिस वन इज़ अ मॉकअप ट्यूटोरियल एंड दिस वन इज़ अ क्रिएटिव ट्यूटोरियल सो हियर इज़ अ डाउनलोड पेज ऑफ द जी पी पिक्जेल डॉट कॉम सो हियर यू आर गेटिंग हियर दिस वन द विंटेज टाइप थ्री डी इफेक्ट्स सो हाउ टू मेक दिस अप आई विल शो यू हाउ टू मेक दिस अप सो आई विल गिव यू दिस डाउनलोड लिंक एंड हियर दिस two portion here is uh, buy for the commercial use and download for the personal use so you can use this one if you just want to buy this one you can use that that is the 0.96 dollar so if you are new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon like for the new notifications so if you want to get the free download that means the personal purpose you should click here and here your name your email address and the purpose you will just give all the requirement you have to fulfill up and press the download your goodies so it will go to your mail that means the download link will go to in your mail so please check out the mailbox after just fill up and just press this button so after that you will get a zip file like that vintage text effect so right press and extract files i'm just uh, use this one the demo version for my personal use and i'm just given you the personal use uh, download and the buy option so you have to choose the convenient options so after unzip this folder or file you will get a folder here is three files and here is the license agreement and this one is another read me read me this one you can read these out and here three portion and three psd files and i'll use this file number one so here the vintage look vintage text that is the 3d type text and for that this one is actually a mock-up that means mock-up means if you just edit the text it will just automatically save this type of effect so let's see how to do that here is the option that is smart object options you have to press it double and it will open up a new window that's good and here the text options you can edit this one so this font i'll give you the download link of this font so you can check it out so suppose i will write down like arif so hit the tick button and file and save this one so after saving this it will just take time and then it will save in that window that means the previous window yeah that's fine and if you want you can just write down anything like mapping hit the tick button control s yeah it will take time and it's just loading it up the progress bar is showing you and it will save in this window so you can change the other steps like this one is the text and this one is another text that is the text effect and the depth here and the shadow as well so you can edit all the things so suppose you want to just edit the depth you can do that and shadow as well so if you need you can change it up so here is assumption to do that so i think this one is more convenient way to make the text like this so here is the background options if you want to edit this one you have to unlock this and double press over here yeah this one is a red color if you want you can change the background suppose i want to add another color so go to the adjustment layer and the solid color and suppose I'll change it out like this and hit OK and press Ctrl S and in this layer it will change it up so it could be a convenient way and this one is more creative way to make your text like that so let's see the other two things so like that go to the file and open up and here here the vintage text the number two options here yeah that's good and here uh, you can use this one so here the another effects that is the texture the square type texture so double press in a smart object it will open up new window 
you can change the font as well so if you want you can go to the like simple font like uh, this type of font so you can do that and hit ok so you have to for this case you have to decrease the font size yeah that is the 350 yeah that's fine and press ctrl s so it will take time and load it up and then you'll get the output in this previous window so like that so you can change it out and same process here if you want you can change the background double press over the smart object before that you have to unlock this one and yeah you can change the color suppose go to the solid color and take this type of like background and press ctrl s and it will change so here is assumption uh, suppose you want to make the font like this type of font so if you have to yeah you have to change the size of the font yeah that's fine and that's good and press ctrl s it will save automatically and give you the output in the previous or main window actually so here it's saving and let's go to the previous window yeah that's fine that's nice and amazing actually so this one is the process of all the things and let's open up the number three options here the text effect logo 3d logo and open it up so the different type of texture actually so here in the different type of texture and other steps if you want to write down something here you can write it down so here the font you can change and if you need you can give another font effect like this and like that and hit the tick button so it will save automatically and here the same similarly in the smart object options if you want you can change it out creative and if you need you can change the font types here lots of uh, like uh, script type font you should use the script type font so i'm just changed it out and hit the tick button and just set it up press ctrl t and you can make it more bigger hit the tick button and save this after saving this one you will get the result in a main window this one is a sub window that means the smart object window you can edit another do things so this one and here if you need you can change the background double press in a smart object before that you will have to unlock this and go to the window and the adjustment layer solid color i'll just give the solid color like this and hit ok and press ctrl s and the background changed and here the text effects so if you need you can change the color how to change the text color here the effects that means the blending option and here you can change the border like if you want you can make it like black so that's fine and hit ok and here fx option that means the blending options and uh, here lots of things you can change it out and the inner shadow and the color overlay if you want you can change the color yeah it changed and like this that means like that so you have lots of assumption to make it out so here the pattern overlay if you want you can change the pattern that means the texture the inside of the text and here the drop shadow as well so those are the assumption to make change this one so these so you are getting that things in these website that means the gp pixels so here are lots of things that is the fee buys and the paid version and other stuffs you can go to that site and you can just use given you just shared this one for you guys those who are included or involved with the creative works so until the next video i may say when i'm signing out today thank you so much thanks for watching my video tutorial if you have any kind of question query request please do comment on my video comment section and if you want to download this mock-up or this type of things you have to go to my 
video detail and you will get the download link over there and the font download link as well and if you want to get more tutorials like these type of creative tutorials i'll give the link of this that tutorial on my video description so until the next video i'm asmr bye bye